He's back. We don't know why you aren't more popular, Fleur. You were selected as the Tri-Wizard Champion of your entire school. That means you're brave and really smart. But you were so hated in the books, especially by Ginny and Hermione. Even your mother-in-law was pretty terrible to you. It's really not fair at all. You are definitely one of the most underrated characters in all of Harry Potter. Flora Delacour isn't the only awesome character that gets overlooked. Keep watching to find out which character is one of the bravest Slytherins ever. Here are 10 Harry Potter characters that are completely underrated. Mischief managed. Creature Creature the house elf isn't exactly likable when we first meet him. Nasty breath standing there as bold as brass. He's angry that Sirius is the only black left because he thinks he's a blood traitor. And Creature really hates Muggleborns. But we soon learn there's a lot more to this elf. He really loved Regulus Black, who died trying to defeat Voldemort. And he is proud of Harry for fighting the war. He leads all the Hogwarts elves into battle against the Death Eaters. Tonks if there's one character that we wish we saw more of, it's Nymphadora Tonks. But she hates her first name, so just call her Tonks. Not here, Nymphadora. Don't call me Nymphadora. Tonks was a Hufflepuff and the daughter of Andromeda Black and Ted Tonks. She was goofy and could change her appearance at will. She's the only metamorphicus we meet in the books. Tonks was also really brave. She was an Auror. She married Lupin and they had a baby. Tonks went to fight in the Battle of Hogwarts even though Teddy was just a couple of weeks old. Unfortunately, she didn't survive. Rita Skeeter Rita Skeeter is a character we love to hate. She's such a great minor villain. Rita is extremely powerful as a journalist. She has a problem with not telling the whole truth, but everyone who reads the Daily Prophet reads her stories. She's also a very talented witch. Everyone loves a rebel, Harry. <laughs> Scratch that last. She's an unregistered animagus, which allows her to spy on conversations. She does end up helping Harry in Order of the Phoenix by writing a factual, nice article about him. Kingsley Shacklebolt the R.R. turned minister for magic doesn't get nearly enough screen time in the movies, but if you read the books, you know he is awesome. He's described as being really cool. He even has an earring. He worked undercover at the Muggle Prime Minister's office. But you can't deny Dumbledore's got style. He was a super brave member of the Order of the Phoenix. He was also a great Auror who stayed working at the Ministry during the war. He is the one who warned everyone that the Death Eaters were coming to Bill and Fleur's wedding. Kingsley becomes Minister for Magic after the war. Remus Lupin he might be a werewolf, but Remus Lupin is one of the kindest characters in Harry Potter. He is definitely the best defense against the dark arts professor that Hogwarts had ever seen. I'm pleased to welcome Professor R.J. Lupin. Good luck, Professor. He is one of the masterminds behind the Marauder's Map. He is best friends with James Potter and Sirius Black. He cared deeply for Harry, and he went undercover with evil werewolves for the war. Lupin died with his wife Tonks at the Battle of Hogwarts. We are still sad about that. So now I'll say goodbye, Harry. I feel sure we'll meet again sometime. Madame Pomfrey it can't be easy being the only healer at a magical school. Can you imagine the types of things Poppy Pomfrey has seen at Hogwarts? Kids in magic are a recipe for disaster, but she does a great job fixing up Harry and everyone else. Madame Pomfrey is also the only person tending to everyone's injuries at the Battle of Hogwarts. Did you know Dumbledore hired her to help Remus Lupin when he was a young werewolf? She's one cool lady. Oh, Mr. Malfoy, stop making such a fuss. You can go. Out of my way. Out of my way. Should have been brought straight to me. Dean Thomas. Harry Potter's dorm mate, Dean Thomas, was a great friend to Harry. He supported Harry many times when other people turned their backs on him. He even defended Harry about Voldemort being back when his best friend Seamus didn't believe it. Dean's biological father was killed by Death Eaters in the First War. Dean has to go on the run in Deathly Hallows because he can't prove that he's a half blood. Why me, Harry? I didn't know you could do that. Uh, and he killed a basilisk. He is kidnapped and held prisoner by Malfoy Manor, and he is saved by Dobby and fights at the Battle of Hogwarts. Minerva McGonagall 
Professor McGonagall is one of the toughest witches around. When she went to Hogwarts, she was a hat stall, which is super rare. This means the sorting hat took a really long time deciding whether to put her in Ravenclaw or Gryffindor. McGonagall is a great teacher, and she defends her students no matter what. She even stands up to Umbridge. Oh, there are several things I would like to say. She really cares for all of her students as if they were her own kids. Flora Delacour Flora Delacour is the Tri-Wizard Champion from Beau Baton School. She is half Vila, which makes her extremely beautiful, but she is a lot more than her looks. She is very clever and does a great job competing in the tournament. She is brave, which is why the Goblet of Fire chose her. Flora Delacour. She is a loving big sister. Flora deals with a lot of hate from the Weasleys, but she doesn't deserve it at all. She and Bill Weasley get married in the seventh book. Narcissa Malfoy Draco's mother is a complicated character. She never becomes a Death Eater, even though her husband and son do. She loves Draco more than anything, and she takes huge risks to save him. She makes Snape take the unbreakable vow, forcing him to protect Draco and kill Dumbledore if Draco can't. Otherwise, Voldemort would kill Draco. She also lies straight to Voldemort's face about Harry being dead when she finds out that Draco is alive. She is one brave Slytherin. Who is your favorite underrated Harry Potter character? Tell us in the comments. Thanks for tuning in. Give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the things.